Here we have the new Acorn E1 wooden earphones. These came to me direct from Acorn and as you can see arrived in perfect condition. What I'm going to do in this video is a quick unboxing and then I'm going to actually use them for about a week and then I'm going to come back with a second part to this video where I give you my kind of feedback as a user. Okay, to start with the unboxing, there's actually two circular sticky tags on the bottom and one on the top. Uh, if you're careful, as I was, you can peel them all off and not damage the cardboard at all, which I particularly like. Let's just turn the box over before, before I slide the inside out. As you can see, it's a slidey outer sleeve. And on the back there, it's all very discreet. It's uh, Apple-esque style packaging, I'd like to call it. Um, but it gives a nice little summary of the various different parts and lets you know there's a 12-month warranty and uh, that it's all approved, CE marked, etc. Okay, let's just slide this box open. So we're going to pop that part out there. And we've now got ourselves a nice traditional lift top lid box. I'm going to just let this open, slide this open. Now it's uh, got a good grip, so you are going to need to just gingerly lift that off, but you don't need to apply any force at all. That just pretty much comes straight off. And already here we are, and we've got ourselves a really nice matte foam black insert here going on. And you can just see the buds. There are all the three sizes small, medium and large. They've already obviously got the medium fitted to the ear earphones on the buds themselves. And you've got here a nice little ribbon, pull ribbon. I'm going to just give that a little tug to lift the foam compartment out of the bottom of the box to reveal, let's flip it over, the coiled cable and the jack, as you can imagine. So it looks pretty straightforward. Just gently tug these out, unravel it, unwrap it, from the foam, it grips it gently but firmly. And I'm going to just lift out the earbuds themselves now, again, being gentle. These are brand new. I can already tell they feel nice. Now I'm going to flip out all of the actual parts onto the table. So I'm going to point out all, so I've got all six buds on the table now. Bottom of my box, I've got a nice little card, business card, contact details, etc. Let me know what's inside the box. So there we go. One Acorn E1, two small earbuds, Two medium earbuds already fitted and two large earbuds. They're made of silicon, so I expect them to be very comfortable to wear because they're gonna be both soft and kind to the skin. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna unravel this and do a little bit more detailed look before I then actually get on and use them. And even though it's been coiled in the box for a long time, it's already become nice and flexible. So it doesn't seem to have a bit of a coil or problems. It feels very nice to touch and I can't see that cable being a problem, but more on that as I use the uh, headphones over the next week. So let's just zoom in a bit. I've already popped on a pair of the large sized earbuds, which is uh, absolutely the right size for me. So let's just get the camera to focus in on one of the buds. There we go, that's much better. So you can see there's a very nice acorn design on the very back. It's good grain to the wood. And what we're going to do now is just pop off that bud. There we go, so you can see the actual speaker grill itself. A fine mesh in there. And also that there's a ridge around the protruding speaker itself onto which the buds click onto. So it's very, very simple. I'm just going to focus as I've got the light in a good position there. There's a really nice little detail with a silver ring on the black edge there. A little bit more visible with the medium, the small bud on, but it's... Uh, it's still subtly visible, even with a large bud on from the side. And all you do is line up the bud you, in particular you want. Of course, line up the middle, let it just slide naturally on as you push it gently downwards. And there you go, you've got a really nice, simple, snug fit. Now, of course, you want to get the right size for your ear. They've supplied you three sizes. I find the large, and I find that's actually giving me a really nice seal in my ear. It's one thing I particularly like about the three and a half inch jack is that it's uh, long and skinny and uh, I've got a, an iPhone 4S here and I've got a particularly chunky case on it and I can easily fit this in. Good connection, no issues. And uh, I'm just gonna bring in an exaggerated example here. Unlike some of the larger kind of three and a half inch jack plugs you get where the surround and the length is just so fat that you can't get it anywhere near. Let me just unplug that. You just can't get it to properly connect because it actually is bouncing off the surround of the case. So all of it black on black, but you get the idea. A lot of a lot of uh, three and a half inch plugs do not fit. This one by Acorn on the E1, absolutely lovely. Goes in very very smoothly into that very small hole there. So that's a, another plus point for me.
I really didn't know what to expect with a pair of sub £30 earphones, but I've been pleasantly surprised. These earphones I find very easy to wear. The bass is rich and clear. It's quite an intimate sound. There's a definitely a warmth, and Acorn, like several other man headphone and earphone manufacturers, are now using wood for its acoustic properties. They, they find that it does have a better resonance. Certainly it feels nicer than plastic, hasn't got the weight of metal, and that lightness also gives you a kind of, am I really wearing my earphones sense, which is, which is quite nice to have still. Okay, I just want to weigh these E1 earphones. Let's pop them on the scales. And as you can see, just over 10 grams at 11 grams. I'm going to drag off the majority of the earphones and put on a single bud, a bit of cable as well, only three grams. And that really does explain why these earphones stay in my ear so easily. That obviously you've got to get yourself the right size bud on them. But once you have and you've got them fitting in your ear, really, really nice snug feel. Just wanted to talk a little bit about the cable. So what I typically am doing is getting these off my, out of my ears, getting these lined up, wrapping them around my fingers like this, just loosely. Last bit of cable, I usually just wrap it around, tuck one part into the loop. That's it, scrunch, scrunch, scrunch in my pocket. And that's typically how my headphones are being looked after. And voila. It really is quite easy. They just don't like tangling these. They are very easy to uh, untangle. It's a kind of friendly cable. Doesn't like to stay straight. Doesn't like to remember curves. It's a kind of perfect kind of uh, in-between cable. Very lightweight, but uh, springy without being uh, ridiculous. Doesn't seem to grab onto or get mucky. This is, you know, some cables get covered in fluff. This just doesn't seem to want to. And uh, for those that want to know the length, 1.2 meters in total, from the jack to the splitter or joint, depending how you want to look at it, that's 80 centimeters. And then you've got 40 centimeters from there to the actual earbuds themselves. And as I say, no issues at all with tangling. I'm gonna wind it around the other way, just in case you're the kind of jack plug to earphone kind of person. I'm sure that works just as well. I don't see why it shouldn't. I'm still gonna do my wraparound loop that I like to do. Just means I've got one slight you know, difference to perhaps any old normal coil or cable. Scrunch, scrunch, scrunch. And once more, let's just see, find the jack. And surprise, surprise, really easy. Cables all ready to go, no problems at all. So I'm finding this a really trouble-free cable. These earphones for a sub 30 pound pair are doing a really great job. And certainly there's a warmth. The base is rich and intimate, clear, doesn't get muddy at all. So it's a very nice sound. Go on, put an acorn in your ear. I hope that this helps with your purchasing decision. Thank you for watching. Please feel free to like, subscribe and comment.